I've been called all these words at one point or another during my six month YouTube journey. And whether right or wrong, constructive or not, I made up my mind long ago that I was going to be unapologetic about the things that I said because they were real to me. And that's no different than somebody like Waka Flocka, Rush Limbaugh, John Stewart, Lil Wayne, or anyone else who at one point made a conscious decision to ignore criticism and speak their piece. Well, let me not say ignore. You can't ignore a troll. They stick out like a sore thumb on your comment section. Their vocabulary is infantile and their grammar puts 50 Tysons to shame. But you have to remember that a troll is somebody who failed at what you're attempting to do right now. Because it's always someone that has three to six videos and the last one was posted a year ago. So they gave up due to their laziness or submitted to somebody trolling them. So now in order to find some sort of a balance, they have to comment on your video to try to get some sort of emotion out of you. Because you notice if you ever reply to one of them they always say something to the effect of lol you mad or they always try to incorporate laughing my ass off in attempts to prove that they are not emotionally invested in this exchange when in actuality they are if you have trolls you have to understand that everybody isn't going to like you and if you're sensitive youtube isn't going to be the place for you but in closing i just have something to say to the trolls out there guys you can call anybody stupid annoying or a hater but one thing that you can't say is that they're not trying. And the one thing that we can say about you is that you're trying way too hard.